Hi everyone, it's Martina and today I'm back with another video and as you can probably already tell by the title of this video, today I'm going to be completing my Christmas Evil collection. Or I guess like not completing because it's already complete, but like putting it away and storing it into my binder. So yeah. So as you can see, these are all the photo cards I have. So technically just these top two rows are the complete collection. So have the green back and the red back, normal ones, the glitter PCs, and then these are like the pre-order for the limited version. And then at the bottom are just my pre-order benefits from Aladdin and um, Music Plant. I think this is Music Plant and Aladdin. I can't even remember. And of course it doesn't say on here. But I think that's those are, those are the two places I got, and I think that's correct because my ladder wants to go out of shit. But yeah, um, I'm finally done. It took me forever. I finally got my last two photo cards in that I was missing, which kind of surprised me, were these two. They actually both arrived yesterday. Ion's Glitter and Suman's Red Back. Um, yeah. Um, I could have traded for Ion's Glitter earlier, but I wanted to just trade with someone. I had a regular PC, and it just happened the person who had the last PC I needed also was trading Jungin's Glitter for a glitter PC I had. But yeah, this one took me the longest to find, which is oh, my cat hair, um, which surprised me. But I'm really glad I was managed to trade all my photo cards. I have to buy anything. I was struggling there for a little bit. I thought I wouldn't be able to do it, but I managed, so I'm very happy. So without further ado, we're just going to go ahead and sleeve, or not sleeve these, put these in the nine pocket pages and then put them away in my binder and then I will be all good. Oh, that's so satisfying. So I'm going to start with putting away the photo card set that came with the limited albums or no, was it just a pre-order benefit? I think it was just a pre-order benefit that all of them came with. Um... Yeah, I'm going to start with putting these away, um, the same way I do with all my Stray Kids PCs. So if you are unfamiliar, I collect OT8 for Stray Kids uh, Korean albums. Um, and yeah, uh, why? I don't know. Uh, my wallet hurts. <laughs> but yeah. Um, I always just leave the middle one empty. Um, and yeah, I collect up like IMU and newer. My collection is not complete going back. Um, my only collections that are completely complete are Noisy and Christmas Evil. I'm just missing one PC for in life and then what I literally just said I leave this one empty and then I'm not paying attention so I put it in. <laughs> um and yeah go live with answer a lot of those are pretty close. Um for my older arrows I don't collect like inclusions just the photo cards for the most part. Um And yeah, certain photo cards, like all the, like the lenticular ones from Levanter and like the pre-order benefits from IMU and the limited from Moreau, like those are very low on my priority list because I mean, those are really hard to get without being overpriced. But for the newer stuff, I'm just doing everything because I can buy it all. Wow, look at that. There's one. And I keep saying it, but eventually one day I'm going to make these into like pretty little things that say like Christmas evil or whatnot, like and look like a little binder. I've seen people do that. I think that would be cute, but until that day comes, I'm just continuing to put white filler cards in there. My binders are very ugly. <laughs> They're not cute like other people's. Um... But they have the photo cards, so yes. But yeah, I've been on a buying hiatus for photo cards for basically since the summer. Gosh, there's cat hair everywhere. Um, because 
I need to get this coming and come back and I need to save up and I'm still on a buying hiatus. I don't really buy any photo cards now. Like I have stuff to trade. I will trade for older stuff, but it's not a priority. I'm not like super into like I'm not like I don't know, last spring when Stray Kids like wasn't doing anything. Well, they were doing a lot of stuff, but they were like on Kingdom, like they didn't have a comeback. I was really big into like trading and trying to like complete my collection, but now I've I've calmed down some now that I've almost almost completed my collection, but I am not there yet. But yeah, they're gonna be coming out with like another comeback probably soon. I mean, the producer, like what well, producer that works with Stray Kids, just tweeted the other day that he's just got a call from them and he's working with them and. They keep saying how they're gonna go on, have like a concert and go on tour after they, their next comeback. So I need to save up money for that comeback and the tour because I am gonna go crazy on this tour. I feel like if they come to the US, when I'm on rotations, I'm already planning to go to multiple stops. So that's my goal. I really want to. Also, like just a lot of groups in general are now coming on tour and I want to go see groups but they don't come to where I live because I don't live in a big city um these are the green back ones that's why I kept calling them a lot of people when I was trading I realized don't didn't know I guess that all these had green backs um or like were confused um when I said that I I didn't think it was confusing but I I guess people were confused I think the issue is a lot of people that when I said the color, they were thinking because these ones come in two different colors, but these are the glitter ones, so. Yeah, I don't really know what's going on with that, but. So. That's how I call them. I realize people just call them A and B, but like, I don't like it when people just call things A and B because it's like, there's no A and B. Like someone just made a template and said, this is A, this is B, you know? And unless, like, if you don't, oh, I thought this was, like, a little, like, edge of the photo card had, like, was, like, feathering. It's just a picture. But, like, when, when it's possible, I like to, like, refer to, like, the photo cards as, like, their own name rather than just, like, A, B, C, or, like, 1, 2, 3, or whatever. Um... So I call these green back or I also just call them like purple cause like the coloring is like they're purple. And the other ones are the red back or just like red cause their backgrounds are red for like all their photos too. Also I keep seeing a lot of people on Twitter saying they're trying to find this photo card or I guess I just saw a lot of people on Instagram too looking for this photo card and I didn't realize it was as popular as it was. I pulled a couple of them. I think I pulled like three of them. Um, yeah basically all the photo cards I pulled were these green bags and I had to trade for all the red bags and I felt like that was most people were trying to trade for red the red bag photo cards and I'm not sure if it's just like people got a lot of the red or green bags or what or like I mean if I had to choose a set I would choose the red bags I'd like the look of it more they're very cute and like pretty but I was still able to cross trade so it's all good um I also like the red backs because the glitter photos are like they're wearing the same outfits that they wore in the green backs where these are like different this is from like the um winter fall not winter falls um 24 to 25 video. They didn't wear these outfits like at all during Christmas Eve. All. But yes, yeah, very cute. And yeah. Hopefully, this video won't be super long. I you know I always make these videos super long. And I also. I just need to stop talking about how they're always super long because I said y'all didn't want to watch a super long video, you can watch it. I like to talk. I like to pretend I'm talking with you guys, even though 
I'm just talking to myself, but I know you guys will be listening to this later on. <laughs> so, you know, I like talking with people who can relate to me who look straight kids. Because I don't really have many stay friends IRL. Beautiful. Magnifique. And then we get to the real pretty ones. Pre-order benefits. I freaking love these. I'm so glad I got these music plant ones. Basically, every single store this comeback had holographic pre-order benefits minus sub K. Shop. And uh, yeah, I really was tempted to get sub K shop for both of them, and I didn't because I decided to be a responsible adult and save money and not buy it on more K pop albums that I don't need just for like the photo cards. Cause I can see the photos, but they're so cute. Um, but yeah. Instead. I just bought 16. <laughs> Instead I was responsible and just bought 16 albums. Oh god. I feel like that really sounds bad. But I did the math. 16 is like the minimum number of albums you had to buy if you wanted to get every photo card if you collect OTA. And like, the, I mean, like, I didn't pull all, like, obviously I didn't pull every card, but like, I was able to trade. Because each album came with one glitter card and then one PC. And there are 16 of those other PCs. And it just happened that that was enough for me to get two. OT8 sets. I've now started doing the thing where if I order from a store, I get eight because look at them. Very pretty. The back is kind of boring gray, but I love these. I love Chan with a little like babushka and like his X eye when it's like and it's like blue. I love Changmin's like crimped crinkly hair. Same with Hyunjin, he's also wearing a little babushka thing with like little snake bite piercing fake things. Felix's hair, like literally they all just look adorable. Oh, so cute. And last but certainly not least is uh, these from Aladdin, I believe. I could potentially have these mixed up, but I'm pretty sure these are from Aladdin. Um, I know the other ones are from Music Plant and I'm, yeah, I ordered from Aladdin, so. These are also winter fall. Oops. Uh, these are also very cute. I like the other ones more, but they are nice and soft, and a lot of them. So I'm gonna take pictures with the ornaments. Very cute. Very soft. I think Han's my favorite from this little set. Like, look at his like red curly hair. So cute. I also love Felix's sticker freckles. Swimming in his beret. They're all super cute. You notice? Newt, newt. Chongan with a pine cone. Anyway, this is all super cute. And these are just white on the background. So. I think this is just gonna be how I, how I put them in. I gotta put them in the album now. Whoops, sorry, I realized I had those too high up. I was sitting down, if you couldn't tell. I was trying to keep them in the frame. But apparently they were not. So here's my um, OT8 Korean uh, binder. Oh, sorry, the glare is really bad. So on this side we have the end of my uh, noisy section. And now we can finally add all these on. Oh, gosh.
Ooh, that glare is atrocious there. Oh yeah, it says there we got the pre-order set, the glitter set, the green back purple set, the red back, just red set, my music plant, POBs, and then Aladdin POBs. And that is it. But yeah, anywho, I hope you guys enjoyed that video of me completing my Christmas Evil OT8 set. I'm really glad to finally have it done. And now I can wait till the next comeback for me to spend all my money that I don't have on Strike It's Love. Yes. If you guys like this video, please make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below for more content. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye. Don't let it fall apart and more than God said Can't you care joy you know I got to Don't let it fall apart and I'm not at all It's a matter of your nothing No, I'm not a joke to the door Yeah, I'm not a joke to the door Yeah, I'm not a joke to the door I'm not a joke to the door